what is up royals welcome back to my channel as you can tell i am in my room because in today's video i will be showing you how to use a baby doppler and or fetal doppler so i will be giving you all my little tips and tricks on how to find baby's heartbeat if you're new to my channel i'm princess nature and i am 15 weeks pregnant today um so yeah if you're interested in this type of content make sure that you subscribe to my channel that you give me a big thumbs up and that you share this video with someone that you think could benefit from it and with that being said let's go ahead and jump right into the video all right so we are ready to get started you're going to need a few things before we go ahead and dive right into it you're going to need your baby doppler in this video i will be using the baby doppler sonalign b i was gifted this by my um soon to be sister-in-law so thank you so much i'm so excited to be sharing this with you guys so this is the one i'll be using in this video whichever one you have i'm sure will be completely fine they're pretty much the same thing you are going to need your ultrasound gel i'm using the one that comes in the box with the baby doppler looks like this sun might be shining a little bit um but if you don't have that it's completely fine you can use aloe vera gel i got this from walmart um it should only be about two bucks so you can use that if you don't have the ultrasound gel and then you're just going to need something to cover your garment um from the gel just protect your clothing you can either use a towel a wash rag i'm just going to use an old shirt that i have works just the same just use anything that you have so yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Before we get started, I just wanted to say one last thing. Um, I've heard of women um, using this around eight, as early as eight weeks into their pregnancy. I'm 15 weeks, so I'm a little bit further along than that, but I'm sure you can find it earlier than that. If you're having trouble finding the baby's heartbeat, do not fret if you're earlier along than I am. Um, don't fret, the baby is still tiny in there. So I went to the doctor and they could barely find my baby's heartbeat at 13 weeks. Thank God they found it, but it is not super easy. It can be for some, but if it's not easy for you, just try daily to find the baby's heartbeat. Don't be afraid. Don't be scared that something's wrong. I'm sure your baby is fine. So yeah. Um, let's go ahead and get started i am going to unbox this okay so i just wanted to quickly go over how this thing works so the first thing that is on your right side is going to be your mode button this button in the middle is your power button and this button way to the left is going to be your black light button so one two three three buttons you have your speaker, which is here. You have your little probe, which you just pull out like that. And it snaps back in. And then way at the top, if you want to be able to hear a little better, you can plug in some headphones. So that's pretty much how this thing works. And let's go ahead and jump right into it. Okay, so first of all, you just want to find a comfortable position. Put some pillows behind your back um, and just figure out what's a comfortable um, position for you. Okay, so this position feels about right for me. Um, and yeah, let's go ahead and get started. First, we're going to take our gel and we are going to put it right on our stomach, right on our belly. If you have any um, belly jewelry, it might be easier to just um, take it out. At this point, I'm not super far along to where my skin is stretching too much, so I'm just gonna take it out for the purpose of this video. And we'll put it right over here where we don't lose it okay so we're gonna take our baby doppler we are going to turn it on 
once you get your Doppler turned on, there are gonna be three modes. I just leave it on the first mode. I have it all the way turned down because I'm gonna put it on my stomach and I don't want it to make too much noise, so make sure the volume is all the way down at first. And yeah, you just go ahead and get started. So, when you put it on here, put it on, just rub it around, and you're going to want to apply pressure and put it at an angle. You probably want to start further down at the pubic bone. Um, because the baby's still down there at that point. Um, I'm a little further along, so I'm gonna start up a little higher. But you do, I find it easier to start in the middle of your belly and work your way outwards to each side. So let's go ahead and try to find the baby. We're gonna turn this volume back up. Okay, so let's see what we can find. Um, your heartbeat is going to be slower than the baby's heartbeat. The baby's heartbeat is going to be beating quite fast. So, let's see. Oh my gosh, that took one second, you guys. turn this down as you can see it doesn't take long to find baby's heartbeat if you're a little further along I am 15 weeks and I'm right in the middle and the baby is pretty much right in the middle let's turn it up let's see if I can find my heartbeat so I can show you the difference okay now that's my heartbeat. My heartbeat is significantly slower than baby's heartbeat, definitely. Baby is really trying not to. Well, baby's moving around. Baby was right in the middle. baby's heartbeat 
sooner than I expected to. Honestly, that took me like two seconds. So that tells me that baby is definitely growing big and strong. And that is super exciting. So yeah, oh my baby is in there. My little baby is in there. It's growing, it's growing y'all. Yeah, so you can use this little towel, your little shirt or whatever to just wipe off your belly. Wipe it on off. And that is it. All right, Royals, well, that is it for this video. I hope that you found it helpful. Um, for you new moms that are out there that are still early along in your pregnancy and you just want to know that your baby is in there and that it's growing because you can't feel any kicks or anything yet. Um, a Doppler is a great investment. I was gifted mine, so I am very thankful. So. I'm very thankful for that and I hope that you enjoy this video. Make sure that you give me a big thumbs up, that you subscribe to my channel and that you share with anyone who would benefit from this video. Thanks again and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.